Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Warriors of Chaos in Grimhammer and um, this episode I think we're gonna end Corone. but oh wait why why are we getting attrition everywhere except here really I mean Sigvald can be here right Okay, it can be here in spots. Bring my mirror shield. And these, these damn orcs I have just born. moved in in our little little chaos ground, like bastards. Why can't I hang out in some places but not others? Come on, I can hang out there. Because wait, what? Why did he start attritioning again? Oh, it's because we're in the same area and it's like animosity or something like that. Maybe. Oh, we need to replenish a little bit, so it's gonna just let that go for a couple of turns. And uh, let's go towards Brass Keep. I mean, our economy isn't great, but it's good enough for now. So let's start passing a little bit. Well, we'll edit these out so we don't sit here and just watch as I pass turns. And the uh, the Skull Smashers are... They're acting like they're Skaven or something. They just waltz into every little ruin and take it over and... Excuse me? Corone just seemed to have... Uh, yeah, confederated with uh, these bastards. Oh, we were supposed to raid that? Well, I didn't know that. Oh, there's Toddbringer. Let's chase him. So, how... How bad is this? It's a lot of knights, which isn't gonna be a problem. It's all the foot stuff that I'm not a fan of. Oh, and we can actually walk in here without... Right, it was because we were in the same... Same uh, province, right? Yeah. So we can hang Let out over here. I completely forgot that that was a thing with the um, with chaos. So let's recover one more turn, and uh, we can get here with Sigvald, so he can help sieging that. And he's almost recovered it as well, so it's looking good. Oh, and we got ourselves a fight here that, I mean, Kolek himself is kind of a raid boss, but all of my other stuff is kind of terrible. So let's just retreat because I don't want to fight both. Oh, well, we don't have a, have a choice, so let's fight it. And, I mean, it doesn't really matter if we win or lose this, because right now Kolek is mostly just costing money, so I just want Kolek because I like Kolek. And it's pretty good for us, fighting their crossbowmen in the woods. Because we can deal a lot of damage to their stuff as long as we get rid of their archers, especially if they just trickle in. So, go after the crossbowman. And as long as we handle, like... Oh, get in there. As long as we handle their spearmen and so on with uh, our infantry, then that's fine. Oh, you're gonna land here, Boris? Go in there. 
should be able to handle that. Take care of the spears. Uh, attack them in the rear. That should be good. Uh, get in there. Spearman, get into the crossbow. I mean, we should win this front line combat. Oh, Sigmar sons, I hate them. Volkmar is a problem. Because of that. But we seem to be winning against the Toddbringer at least. And we get rid of their dang crossbowman. That's good. Oh. Toddbringer left. Because I think we can definitely just... Just... Uh, Ball both are up and toss them out in a little in a little bin somewhere. And there's another damn soul fire bombardment. Ow. Yeah, so I don't think we're gonna win, but we can at least do a lot of damage to them. And if we win it's only because of Kolek, but Kolek is taking a lot of damage and Volkmar has 100 HP left and he's getting out of there. Kill Toddbringer. You should come back, yeah? I think so. Oh, get Volkmar. They're dead. Perfect. Where did Todd go, or the bringer, of, bringer of the Todd. Yes, I, I hate fucking flagellant, unbreakable pieces, pieces of shit. Well, he's dealing with those at least. Deal with the pikemen. Sigmar sons are running off our uh, our marauders, but Kolek <laughs> counts for a lot. Oh, go after that guy! Take the witch hunter. Go after them. They are shattered. Uh, come on, kill the witch hunter, because he can actually deal damage to us. These can as well. The flagellants don't matter. Get those. Oh, right. And he can... He can shoot while running, but he is slower than us, and we are catching up. So, just... Just get him. This doesn't... No, we already popped that. Right. Well, they seem to be breaking, at least. Come on, Kolek. Get there. Because if we kill the, uh, kill this guy, then I don't think there's that much they can do. Well, this is a problem too. But their infantry can't really deal with Kolek, I think. And... There we go. And he's stopped in fight. And he's, he's gonna die real quick. Come on. Kill him. Kill him. Come on. There we go. <laughs> oh, it just turned into paste. We go kill those flagellants now. Okay, uh, run towards Kolek. Kolek, run towards the flagellants. And I guess short in actually. But you keep chasing these crossbowmen. Oh, and we have someone over here. Oh, they. Well, let's see if they come back. Kill the flagellants. Should just turn into paste. Oh, yeah. I love Kolek. He's just. He doesn't give a shit. 
He just walks in and everything just dies. But our Chaos Marauders are still wavering, so kill some more of these. There we go. Come on. Oh. Club here! Don't, don't club it one little guy. That's good, yeah. That's what we want to see. Good colic. The, I think the crossbowman just routed. Good. Let's go and help kill the Sigmar sons. There we go. Charge into the crossbowman. Good. We're able to to make them rout or shatter. So. Now we don't have any crossbowmen to worry about, while Kolek takes care of these Sigmar sons, because they have more unbreakable shit, which is incredibly annoying. Oh, and... <laughs> Why did you break? You were just chasing... Chasing fleeing stuff. Oh, and... And Kolek broke... What? Why did you break? This is just because of army losses, but it should be fine. You should be fine. What's your problem? Damn sustained. I mean, you haven't taken that much damage. You're fine. Let's have the damage sustain come back a little bit. Because that should go away over time. Right? God, I hate unbreakable stuff. Oh, run away. Yeah, so the damage sustain is getting better. Just let that tick away a little bit. Because otherwise we'll just route as soon as we get within contact with those guys. Yeah, fine. I mean, they can't... Whatever. Well, they can't... Whoa, what? Oh, right. Oh, shit, I'm an idiot. I fled. Oh man, I should have just stand, stood and fight the first time. Okay, that was stupid of me. Well, that helps our economy at least, so that's something. I shouldn't have backed off. I thought I thought we were far away enough for them not being, to be able to chase, but I was entirely wrong. And... Hello. Yeah, sure, let's fight this. Partly because we were gonna lose some units, but also we haven't fought any dwarves yet. This is this is gonna be fun. And I feel think we just leave the demonets with the rest of our army yes. to a big old front line. We can make that even bigger. Let's put you there. You can be in groups. Group two. It can be one. Go hang out there. Oh, we put you there. That doesn't matter. Okay, so. Uh, number one, move over there. Actually, move over there. Ow. Thank Thanks, Thunderers. Oh well. Let's see how much a volley does. I think we're better off leaving, but yeah. Get out of there. 
It's a bad trade. They have so many ranged units. Let's get out. Yeah, that's that was a bad idea. I guess they have to go in with with the infantry. So move up. So we just have to go fight them. Fight them on their terms, because they have. They have missile superiority. So, actually, just block and attack. Let's go after that, and you can ride up now. Let the infantry go up first. We're gonna use you to actually charge into stuff. Ooh, that's a that's a strong magic missile there. And Forsaken is rampaging in somewhere else. That's fine. So, is there anything we want to charge into? Yeah, let's charge into this Thunderer. Maybe we can get behind. That would be nice. Let's pop that there. Let's pop that there. Let's kill and break these Thunderers. So we can just ride through them. And envelop. Flank collapsed, so now we can just envelop their entire army. And as, so as soon as you break, we can just. Yeah. Ride through. Oh, we can charge you. Although you chase those off. Get him. And some limp ass charging we got there. Run! Yeah. But they're being run down at least. We are doing fine over there. All of this is breaking. Collapse in there. Begin the reaping. Just collapse in. And charge in behind. These should break really quickly. Yeah. They just need that rear charge and they're broken. And then there's this blob. But they should break quick. Good. That was... That was really efficient as soon as we got in there. Okay, so... The Dwarven plan didn't work out. And um, weapon strength, five turns for a thousand gold. Now nah, I think we take the thousand favor. Sorry, that's fine. So yeah, Kolik is dead. Well, wounded. Oh well, not much we can do about that. That's my mess up. And um, I shouldn't have ran away. Oh, we get a decisive victory. We don't even have to fight. So, low casualties. Let's just... I think we can auto-resolve this. And occupy Corone. I, I wonder... No, there's nothing... Nothing special here. These are neat. Oh, I just 
saw how expensive those were. <laughs> and yeah, we still need tier four to get casters anywhere. That's annoying. Let's just grab some money. Oh hey, we're making money again because Colic died. Oh, and Middenheim can be upgraded. Seems like I missed an opportunity and should have gotten this a while ago. But then there's only one more one more tier and then we have 50 turns away. Man, they... Hey! We got another another quest to do. But I don't feel like doing that right now because, well, we're doing a lot of quests lately and we just had to have to replenish so much afterwards and it's annoying. Oh, and now we can't afford this again. Oh, well, that's fine. We should check what you got. I mean, Dragon Helm isn't great. Armor of Fortune is fine. I mean, the ward saving with physical resistance is pretty... Oh, that's that's what we got to choose from. So, I guess Armor of Fortune is fine then. Um, Warrior's Bane is really good. I like Shrieking Blade to give terror, but I think I like Warrior's Bane more, actually. Might be a like, common weapon, but I like the weapon debuff, and it gives a little bit uh, what you might call it? Uh, melee defense. But I do want actually I should probably give him the Shrieking Blade because Terror is so so good. Yeah, let's give him it. Give it to him. And I guess more ward save is good. Don't feel like we fight that many flying units. So let's just get the ward save. And I guess you can have the fireball since since um, Archeon doesn't use it anymore. And we might use it more often on you because maybe I, re I remember to use it when you don't have spells to cast. Oh, um, that's pretty good. Oh, but we have this to do. Although, do we have any high ranking? No, there's no point in getting it except for like Chaos Warriors because Mirror Guards. So there's no point in getting this except to get a standard die, which is good. But I mean, we won't get this bonus yet. So I'd rather have this because plus 10 more, uh, melee attack for Marauder units and physical resistance is pretty good considering how many Marauder units we, ha we have. And there's... I find it weird that there's no... Regiment of Renown for Chaos Marauders. I feel like there really should be some. Who are these but, oh well. I guess since it is a very old faction and hasn't gotten any new toys, they really don't... Uh, they really didn't give many... many Regiment of Renowns back then, so they haven't gotten any new ones because they haven't gotten any, any updates. Oh well. Oh, where? where? Why did we go there? Hey, we know everyone that has a port at least. So... Oh, did you kill... Did you finish off the Barrow Legion? It seems like you did. Let's see, where are... There they are. Yeah, they finished off the Barrow Legion. For some reason, they never seem to do that. They just seem bad at it. Bring my mirror shield. So let's go over there. My Camp. So... I think you should be able to take... Castle Artois on your own, right? I mean, Knights of the Realms aren't great. Bowmen should be fine. Then it's mostly man at arms with squares and stuff, and. Avert your eyes. Your Chaos Marauders are pretty strong, so. should be fine. Be a 
And we do need to replenish though. So let's replenish some more. So, how is your stuff look? Pretty alright. How would this look? Will this be okay? Yeah, we can even not resolve this. But I think I want to end the episode with this fight. Or do I? Yeah, let's fight it. I mean, we could just auto resolve this, but we can also fight it. And I, I for once, feel like fighting this, this uh, uh, siege battle. Let's move you up. We're just gonna do the same thing we did last time with this army and just storm the walls, stay there until we can just descend on them. And you will be a vanguard. It's fine. Oh, and these should be their own little group. So, take the walls. Oh, get on that. Get on that. And get on that. Oh, we are gonna lose more than we need to, I think. I think we're probably gonna lose more than the other assault because... I don't think they calculate how much damage we would have taken by the towers and so on, but that's fine. Oh, pop, pop. There we go. I almost missed it. Just ride around and shoot what you can. As soon as we get stuff up on the walls, Archers will stop shooting and we'll probably put these like over here or if we take the towers here then we'll put them over here and start climbing you idiots. Oh and Sigvald got this got these five ladders himself. He just strong armed five ladders on his shoulders and smacked them up against the wall. <laughs> Uh, can you shoot this ball on the ball? Nah, I don't think so. Probably not. Okay, and I don't think they can shoot anything right now, so go stand over there so the towers don't shoot you. You see, you'll just take unnecessary damage. Oh, and you're just gonna glow like this, are you? So let, let's look, the ma look at the manticore instead. Oh, beautiful. Kill him. And Forsaken running up. That is nice. What do you mean? Kill us on the earth. Uh, go and help. Oh, this is a terrible place to climb. <laughs> they actually have, yeah, they actually have control over this. Oh, now we got control, but it's still shooting us. There we go. Oh, and you need to keep fighting. Go kill those foot squires. You can go help. You can go help. Ah, dang it. Good. Can you shoot those? Do you have an arc? I don't think so. Ah, uh, probably not. Okay, so stand over here. We can probably take this gatehouse. Maybe. Maybe not. Go take these great swords. These demonettes should go fight. And these demonettes should go fight. Okay, well, if you're gonna be like that, let's give you some chaos bomb. 
So don't like you shooting at me. Slay every mortal. Uh, just chase that peasant mob. Because if we can just... All their knights are over here, right? If we, if we can just break these peasant mobs, which we would do really fast... Oh, actually, we get a good firing arc here. That's great. Because then we can get these horse masters in. They would actually do a pretty good job if we can just get them inside. So let's take the gate. And I think all of these are hero. in. So let's Masters, send these over there. Send you down. Send you... Oh, Charge! Sigvald just went in. That's what the Masters Oh, that's fine. Can you shoot? Hey, fireball worked. I just feel it. Some, it often just doesn't want to go off when it's when he's in uh, when the when the caster is in melee. And I don't know why, but it's really annoying. Oh, get him! The gate will open. And they will break fast from a cavalry charge through the gate. And once they do, you can just send them in back here. Go after them. For the chaos gods. Go on, you magnificent bastard. Kill them. Looks like he's face is like blurred out. Good job, Sigvald. You should really have gone down by now. Get the bowman? You can charge over there because these guys are done. They will succumb. I'm so looking forward to the third game with the upgraded siege system. Fight. Oh, actually, you are. No. You're Knights of the Realm. I don't want to get in melee with you. So. Throw shit at them. Because you are anti large. You will do fine work against that. The girl prince speaks. Yeesh. Signal is taking a beating. He will be fine. Oh, you're doing good. And we sh it should be more valuable to sit here and shoot these and charge in. Actually, maybe we, sh we should just charge them. The oh, they're breaking. Well, let's break them faster. There we go. Nice. That was a fun fight, but I feel like Sigvald might have taken more damage than he needed to. Just let him hang out there by himself, but... In my defense, I didn't know he was in there by himself. Oh, can you? No. So close to be able to afford that. But Archeon is gonna go take Fort Berg Bergress. Sigvald can take Gizro, or however that would be pronounced. And then there's just Blackstone Post left. And we might as well take Karak while while we're at it. And... Oh yeah, <laughs> Reichland Confederated, was it Noln or whatever they called over here? And uh, it seems like the vampires just jumped on them. 
So, once again, this is Raglan's only, only settlement, right? Oh, I think we went past... No, Kislev is their own. No, they actually have two settlements. Now, where is the second one? I don't know. I guess it's somewhere on, around here, but... That will be taken care of by the vampires really quick. So. Get in, in camp and replenish some more. And I think we're going to end the episode there. So. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, what do you want? Yeah, sure, whatever. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider leaving a comment and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.